Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sue of Bend and Stretch with Sue. In today's video, I'm taking you through a partner yoga practice done with my lovely daughter, Alicia, and myself. We start off on the lake side in hero pose with hands on partner's thighs, taking some deep breaths, centering as we prepare. From here, we move into a seated position, reaching to link hands as we come into a half boat. So starting to wake up the core as we activate the abdominals, supporting the back, creating a beautiful stretch through the back of the leg as we alternate from one side to the other. testing the balance as we move into a full boat. Breathing for approximately three to five breaths while we hold. And then moving back to back, keeping the spine tall, sit bones grounded as we move into cross-legged. From here, we continue to elongate the spine in a seated twist reaching for the partner's opposite knee. Relaxing the shoulders well away from the ears, softening the face. Be the chest proud. Great way to limber the spine particularly having that extra reach for your partner's leg. We search here to link the arms, press through the feet and move up to standing. Coming into a hinge from the hip creases as we reach through this wide angle, forward bend, linking hands to have your partner assist you into deepening your forward fold. Once again, it's a great way to stretch the backs of the legs. As one foot turns out and the other toes point toward the long edge of the mat, we move into triangle pose and revolved triangle. This further awakens the core, really helps to stretch the hips as well as the chest, shoulders, and then switching to the opposite side as once again, Alicia demonstrates triangle while I move into revolved triangle. Reaching for each other's hands helps to deepen that twist, that, that stretch. Taking the, go, the gaze upward is going to help to deepen that stretch even more. Moving to opposite ends of the mat, a big reach upward hands reaching for your partner's upper arms. As you allow the weight of the chest, the weight of the torso to really help to deepen that forward fold. Reaching through that posterior chain to lengthen it. Inhaling to reach for the sky, hands float to the heart as we shift positions here. Alicia moving from a high plank to an assisted back bend. Now by turning and facing away from Alicia, I allow myself to challenge the balance further. And as I allow the chest to open, we both benefit from a great 
anterior body stretch, chest, shoulders into the abdomen. Moving into a downward dog. Positioning myself for a larger downward dog. Really moving into a handstand preparation. Great strength for the core while deepening Alicia's downward facing dog. From here, Alicia reaches forward into a seated forward fold while I move into a standing forward fold deepening Alicia's stretch by pressing on her legs and shifting my body weight onto her upper body while holding on to the big toes with that yogi lock and testing the balance as I continue to press her further into that fold. From here, we move into seated facing each other, all the way down into a supine position. Alicia moves up into a bridge while I deepen my bridge into a plow pose, keeping the hips lifted, getting up onto the tops of the shoulder blades. Alicia now uses that plow to move herself into plow as well. Holding on to our forearms, we're meant we remain in that partner practice. As Alicia unrolls, I'll continue to hold plow longer. Plow is a great way to stretch through the back lines of the body. It's a very deep forward fold. And going even deeper now as Alicia switches her forward fold position. So you can see we're both doing the exact same position. However, one upright and the other inverted, same pose great benefits. She comes into that boat. Moving back to face the partner, closing the eyes as once again we reach for partner's legs, breathing, allowing the practice that we've just done to really integrate within the body, mind, and soul. As we bring it to conclusion, taking that final stretch, hands come to the heart with gratitude, bowing to acknowledge your partner.